do. Chalk it up as a learning experience. You'll be better prepared next time. But I like this guy. Well, then you shouldn't have texted him six times and done his laundry. <laughs> Sounds true. All right, Casual is a new comedy series airing on Hulu. It's about a divorced mom who now finds herself having to move in with her brother. The show stars two TV veterans, Michaela Watkins and Tommy Dewey. Both join us now to tell us more about their new show. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Congratulations on the show. All right, well, let's do ladies first. How do you describe what this new uh, show, Casual, is all about? <laughs> Michaela. Um, um, well, uh, I was teasing. I'm Michaela. And um, I would describe uh, the show. It's, uh, it, Tommy, you just feel free to jump in here. It's a show about a brother and sister. And uh, they're at a point in their lives in their mid to late. 30s, where uh, my character Valerie is newly divorced, finds out her husband did some terrible things, and uh, she ends up moving back in. Uh, not back in, but she moves in with her brother, uh, with her 16-year-old daughter. And, and I'm the last person you would w want guiding you through this phase of your life. <laughs> through uh, the hardest time in your life, but actually maybe the best. Oh, that's sweet. No. Yeah. Aww. Um, well, best for good TV, right? This makes yeah. for some pretty funny shows ahead, right? Yeah, yeah, there's this really messy sibling relationship against the backdrop of modern dating and sex and all that stuff. Um, and, uh, and, you know, it's, it's fun to kind of jump back and forth between the two and, and, and weigh those two different kinds of relationships against one another. The, the familial thing versus the romantic thing and how the two of them can, can screw with one another. And uh, we, um, um, I think we've, uh, we've between those uh, in a funny and, and cool way through the, throughout the season. Now, the show is named Casual. Where did you think they, or, you know, why that name? Why is that name picked as the, the title of the show? Why the term casual? You know, casual can be a word that sometimes people use to describe certain ways of um, having relationships, i.e., ca can I say casual <laughs> sex at this hour of the morning? It sure, why not? Okay, Go ahead. I'm Absolutely. saying it. I'm owning it. <laughs> casual sex. Casual sex. The, the, the ratings are just going through the roof now. Um, <laughs> yeah, you really owned that. I like, went ahead. Get a, give over to Fox now. Michaela's, Michaela's gone off the rails. Um, no, but, uh, you know, I, I can relate to this character because I think it would be terrifying to sort of go from a 16-year marriage that suddenly crumbles and then being out there in the world. It's like, wait, what? I, you know, I, I had the comfort of this familial person that I, not familial, but familial person with the husband <laughs> who, who you know, and then all of a sudden you're putting yourself out. It's got to be so vulnerable and icky. And, um, but it's also a way to get to know yourself. I mean, if you are suddenly no longer the wife and you have a daughter who doesn't really need you because she's 16 years old, doesn't need you in the same ways, you start to have to ask yourself, well, who am I without the reflection of these people back at me? So it's about sort of uh, Valerie is kind of breaking apart and putting herself back together in new ways with the aid of her incredible um, interesting and very dynamic brother. Yeah, I think casual, the, the term is also meant to be ironic. I mean, these are people that they are very open with one another and they and it, it, early oh, yeah. on in the season they seem to have a casual uh, um, attitude about things, but th that's that's kind of a mask. It's, a, it's, uh, it's something they throw up as a defense mechanism because they've, they've got some pretty dark demons that um, start to present themselves as, as the series moves forward uh, in a funny and really interesting and surprising and Dark way, so <laughs> stick with the show, and, it and it's gets a comedy. Nuts. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, it's hilarious. Yeah, well, and the re the reviews have been phenomenal. Critics are giving it a lot of praise, and I wanted to get your thoughts on this before we close on the idea of this show being on Hulu. This is the new way people, you know, myself included, are watching TV, where we can binge watch shows and TV. Talk about this new outlet, and how does this change maybe how you guys decide what projects you're going to do and what roles you pick. Did you know that this was going yeah, to be on Hulu? It, it makes before quite honestly, we are happy as yeah, clams at high tide because right it is it is um, creatively. You know, Jason Reitman has been able to really, uh, you know, through the script of Xander Lehman, been able to really create such a unique world, and uh, it's more about you know. So these digital platforms really support the creative, you know, and tell these unique stories in unique ways. I mean, some of these tropes may sound familiar, dating, sure, divorce, sure, uh, family drama, sure, but 
it's never been told this way. And that's what really drew us to it was because uh, Hulu was creating, Hulu was making this show that, um, you know that old adage, like all the stories have been told but not by all the storytellers? And this is... Oh! This, do you know what, Tony? That's wonderful. Oh, there right you go. Down. That's free. That's for you. Hulu's uh, also a place that has a ton of energy, right? Yeah. It's a really fun, it's a fun group of people from the top down to be involved with. They're really excited about their new slate of programming. They're really supportive of what we're doing. Yeah. Oh, and the way they're releasing it, you know, it's they're doing an interesting thing too, is they're releasing two today. Uh, and then, um, and then one a week, uh, one every Wednesday, and and or you can binge it all at the end. I mean, however you like to digest your your TV. <laughs> we like the one a week thing because it's sort of the show builds on itself. They're not standalone episodes. It sort of plays out like a movie. Yeah, if you if you do it, if you start today and do it every Wednesday, it lends itself to some good uh, water cooler. Chatter. I also need that discipline enforced. Um, <laughs> or he never leaves his house. Upon myself, or uh, yeah, I would just I would just be stuck on the couch. Yeah, and I'm, binging things. Well, and I'm right there with you. I'm so addicted to binge watching. All right, so guys, thank you so much. Congratulations you. again on the new show. Thank we know you. it's going to so be much. great. We're going to be tuning in, whether it's just one episode or maybe maybe we'll just wait, binge watch it all. Thank Appreciate you guys, it. Thank, thank you, Carly. Thank you. We of course.